So Norcross College is part of the City of Edmonton's Building Energy Benchmarking Program. Uh, that program is going into its sixth year and the college has been part of the program since its inception. Really the, the program allows us to measure our performance versus our peers, particularly in the college and university category. We're very proud here at Northwest College to be one of the top performers or be the top performing building in that category for the last several years. Changing for Climate. Hi there, welcome to Northwest College. I'm Jason Schuler. I'm manager with our facilities and operations team. So just like to share with you here a little bit about our two buildings here. We've got the Singmar Center for Learning, which is a new building built in 2018. LEED Gold certified. And next to it here is the Civic Employees Legacy Tower, a renovated building in 2019. Educational institutions use a lot of energy. Norquest uses $1.3 million worth in its two downtown facilities. The easiest way to reduce energy use is to build efficiently at the outset. But for existing buildings, energy monitoring can provide the data you need to make some informed retrofit decisions. Norquest built the new Singmar Center for Learning and at the same time renovated their existing Civic Employee Legacy Tower, which Jason refers to as the Kelt Building. The Singmar Center for Learning is certified LEED Gold and so there's a, a bunch of things that we did. Uh, some of the really neat features um, are you know, our atrium light well deflected where we are right now in our atrium. We have uh, a rainwater collection system uh, down in our parkade. We've got a uh, cascading heating plant where we share the heating water from our kelp building into the Singmar Center for Learning. We've got a heat recovery wheel here in our penthouse. Um, foundational things like LED lighting and lighting control systems across both buildings. I think the coolest feature here is our cascading heating plant. So that's our boiler plant in the kelp building that takes the heat and heats that building and the return water that comes out of that building comes over to the Singmar Center for Learning and heats this building and then returns back to the heating plant. And I think that's, that's cool that we're using that heating water actually twice. Saving energy from exhaust air is also very important. And Norquest has a giant heat wheel that recovers as much as 80% of the heat from the exhaust air. Jason also shows a special double window system that helps save energy. And so we're walking in this giant window. Solar heat gain uh, comes in, it gets trapped into this space instead of going into the, into the room next door, uh, which allows us to manage, reduce our energy for cooling and conversely in the winter this is a good insulating space so we're not losing a bunch of heat through the exterior um, which reduces our heating requirements for the adjacent space. You may have heard the expression you can't manage what you don't measure. Building energy benchmarking certainly got Norquest thinking about the importance of data. So much so they've even installed the first phase of a sophisticated energy monitoring system that they're now planning to expand to the entire facility. It was earlier this year we looked at some of our cooling equipment here in the Singmar Center for Learning and it really came down to we have a large piece of chiller equipment and a kind of a smaller piece of equipment and we found through monitoring the data that this big chiller was running in the middle of the night just cycling on and off and that wasn't very energy efficient and it wasn't good for the equipment and so we made some changes to our system to ensure that the smaller chiller came on in the middle of the night when the demand was there and we found by making those changes we saved you know roughly 20 percent in energy so this is really you know kind of the i guess the shining star the good example of just what this data management can do and so we saved 20 percent which is roughly two to three hundred dollars in energy savings for this one finding alone and so if you can imagine rolling that out to the entire campus the opportunity uh, I think is quite great for us to explore other savings and efficiency gains. Going one step further, Norquest also started to inventory their greenhouse gas emissions. Going back to comparing sustainability uh, last year and the year before where we saved 3% on our greenhouse gas emissions, that really translated into like a 3% energy savings. And that 3% on a million or $1.3 million is you know over $30,000 a year saved on uh, utility costs and if you kind of roll that out over four or five years that's $150,000 which is is fairly significant. Changing for climate. To learn more about navigating building energy management and retrofit planning visit changeforclimate.ca slash buildings.